Hey guys, it's Banner. Welcome back to Strife. In the last part, we uh, found out that a certain person has been doing some traitorous stuff behind our back. And in this part, we're going to say hi to the Lawmaster. Now, I think I may have needed... Damned impressive entranceway. But what we're searching for is on another level. Head down. So we're heading into the Proving Grounds, which, by the way, we're on the uh, kind of okay storyline. This is not the good storyline. So what happens is this is actually like the final big long level of the game and we kind of start like we still have to kind of do it we we still have to do this level like legit turrets turrets hate the turrets gotta hate the turrets because they give me turrets there's so many guys everywhere but i don't Uh, 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 door. Dang, I don't want to shoot, I don't want to shoot, I don't want to shoot, but I'm stuck, because this, this thing's not open. And I think I've completely screwed it up on my end, because I've lost all my health. There's a door, and it won't open, and I'm really, really confuzzled. Just keep firing rockets, they'll never learn. There are so many guys, it's ridiculous. This flamethrower. They'll never, they'll never get me now. <laughs> Wait, why am I using the flamethrower when I can use this thing? In super duper BFG mode. That's the BFG, by the way. The standard shots are okay. It's a bit underwhelming, to be honest. Uh, did I just use the invisibility instead of the actual speed up? That barely uses much more ammo, and it probably kills everything. I'm a little bit afraid about this room right here. Because there's a bajillion guys. That, there we go, they opened it. And more enemies, nice. Nice, nice, come on, come on, come on. Oh crap, I'm on fire. <laughs> you can set yourself on fire by the way, it's just a death animation thing, but uh... Yeah, I gotta do all this again. Nice. Nice. I'm totally skilled at this, guys, don't you worry. This is why I chose the, <laughs> the kinda hard difficulty level. Because I'm an idiot. I actually don't know if the difficulty level even is uh, is more enemies or uh, it actually increases the damage output by enemies. I feel like that's a thing. Maybe we actually know where we're going this time around. And we keep quick saving all the time. Yoink! Standing on a phosphorus grenade, dude. Ah! There are so many enemies, it's ridiculous. It's like, ah! And, and by so many enemies, I think it's mostly just the freaking, like, laser guys. That maybe singular, they're okay, but in a huge pack like that, that's ridiculous. That's so ridiculous. And I don't want to trigger the room behind me, that's the problem. How about we just use a sigil? And everybody has aggroed. The end. Now the, sig the sigil is using a ridiculous amount of health, so I'd rather not just like keep using it. But it's a good like last resort. So, yeah, so the Proving Grounds is a bit of a weird level because it has all these teleporters that keep going to the same... Oh my gosh, dude, I'm just like lobbing rockets everywhere and then it's just like, ah. 
Also, let's have a teleport that leads right back to the start, but let's not lead them directly to the switch that opens where they need to actually go. Yeah. Oh my gosh, all these freaking guys right here. Spider on the ground. I'm a little bit worried of walking into this room over here. You guys hear this. Well, this is why we got all this phosphorus. Oh, jeez. Because they'll just walk into it and they'll all die. Maybe. That is such realistic looking fire. Also, the phosphorus lasts for a while, I just noticed. Hmm. You see what you're dealing with? What the heck did I just get caught on? Quick! Get in! And run! To the next room! Out! Oh my gosh, dude, look how many freaking guys are there! What is this? Why are there so many? And turrets, you gotta hate them every single time. So I believe we should... Oh my gosh, it's just every time I want to get somewhere, there's always something in the way right there. Oh, jeez. <laughs> hey, actual room to circle strafe, people. Excuse me, rockets, stop hitting the ground. I gotta jump every time I shoot, because I'm worried I'm just gonna hit the ground. But I believe this is... My gosh, it's just, you walk into a room and this is this guy. This guy is the biggest, like, he's probably the bulkiest guy of them all. And there's just a bajillion of them. And then you've got the freaking floaty guys, and it's just like, ah, oh, I don't want to deal with them. Ah. And this is why I probably should have invested in some health before we went into here, but stop it. What did I just get hit by? What just hit me at that very end? Could you pause for a second? What? I'm getting a little sick. What? Ahead, Why did I not get telefragged last time? Oh, that's how he got behind me, because he freaking telefragged me. Wow! Wow! Do you guys see how dangerous quick saving is? Uh... Eh! Eh! Why aren't you activating? Good enough, good enough, good enough, get out of that. And all my health's gone again. Nice. Where the heck? There's people just going from everywhere. Literally everywhere. Literally everywhere. I can't even deal with it. There we go. And then you got. Oh. <laughs> Why did I play on this difficulty level? Oh, oh my gosh, you're kidding me. You're not dead. There you go. And there's guys up here too. There's guys everywhere. At least there's health kits up here. At least there's a lot of things up here. Which is nice. And we got a doorway up to this higher ledge. So it's okay. And there's guys just getting jammed on everything. Nice. And there's guys behind me as well. Jeez, the turrets. You just walk into a room and it's just like, oh, turret. I'm getting so angry right now because I'm just dying tons. Remember, this is like the last part of the game. On a regular plate. I didn't hit a switch. Nice. You're just like, oh, you went to the wrong room? Quick! Let's just completely kill the player. Yeah. There's a turret up here too. Nice. I'm on really low health, and there's this guy right here. And there's another one! There is another one! You gotta be kidding. Just take a hit. Take a hit. You take a hit. one too, I guess. I'm getting hit by a turret over there! Just... Turrets ever, there's freaking 
Enemies leaking from the walls! What is this? They're just coming from everywhere. It's so ridiculous. Like, I'm, I'm out of health again. Oh my god, I shot this guy. Come on. There's a switch in here. What's that switch even do? Who knows? If it's the doors from way back, then yay. What is even the point of like being up on this ledge? I don't think there is one. Could be like great health gets on the back here, but you can you could probably get up to this ledge from behind as well, yeah. And let's go up here because I think there could be a door on this side that's open up. Nope. Nope. More like. I was gonna say, yeah, you don't have to really kill all the enemies, but I guess we have to. I guess we have to. And the doors aren't even open. What have I done? Where's the switch? Oh my gosh. Dude, we're freaking like 11 minutes and we're just still kind of sitting here at the beginning of the area. Because, oh my god, you see? Do you see this madness right here? Right here. Do you see that madness? That is just insane. So it's gotta be like a switch in here, right? Because that, that switch definitely did something, but what did it do? Oh, because there's a teleporter right there that puts you behind everything. It puts you like on a high level. Oh, yeah, yeah, and then you gotta go in the hole, yeah. I remember this level is just. It's teleporter exit. I'm getting so frustrated at this level, I have no clue why. Hey. By the way, I on my original playthrough, I got the freaking like final weapon there out of all things. You may be going like, oh, that's not so bad. You just got like a little bit after the previous time. This is the end of the game, by the way, guys. Like the hardest level in the game, and for some odd reason, the bad <laughs> the bad story just goes nah. You gotta you gotta play through it. I did I quick save any time nearby. No, I didn't. <sighs> I get so- I'm so frustrated because I just do like something dumb and I'm like, oh that's okay, I'll just undo it. And it's just like, nah. You can't undo it. You can't undo life. I gotta go in that direction. Oh, the switch activate that, okay. I just hear them, they're all around me, and I'm like, ah. So I think that switch just activates one on the inside. Yeah, that. And because of Doom, you can just kind of trigger it from like way above. But there's nothing long term in there. So the big question is where is the switch? The hunt for the missing switch. Who even designed these buildings, like, really? They're just everywhere, they're just everywhere, they're just hitting me from just everywhere. I don't really know why they're doing this. That just leads me back out here. I don't want to be out here. I think I have single-handedly killed everything in this area. I don't want to be out here though, because all that does is just activate a switch that I've already gone through, and I don't think there's anything on the outside, at least, of this area. So really, that just means, like, what is uh, left? You can kind of see into it. There, that's the next area. The only thing I can think of is, uh, taking full damage like that, because I'm an idiot. Ah! What about you, you sewer? 
the sewer the sewer doesn't have anything except puts you outside here but then you're like dude how do I get in there oh my gosh I'm an idiot there's a staircase up here that probably leads into there yeah it does switch that yep yeah, doors open Thing. Like this freaking turret and this thing that I still don't know what it is. Why are they giving freaking tranquilizer darts? So then they put like these three teleporters here. You go, okay. And then, like. Oh my god, I'm stuck. I'm just. I'd rather not get mauled by these things and then there's just guys everywhere guys everywhere oh my gosh there's, there are enemies everywhere I, I do remember this though I do remember this you gotta do like something really particular with the you can basically use this thing like a shotgun but there's not a lot of ammo for it and especially because it uses the flamethrower ammo, so you're just like, oh. It's weird, because it doesn't create like any like recoil or anything, unlike the other weapons. Hold on, we... Dude, this is... Oh, that's, yeah, that's where I gotta go. Like, end goal. So, yeah, so you drop down here here and then just pops you in the middle of Death Valley right here. If I drop down, there's a teleporter there, but I know that there's just getting wrecked by the same thing. Oh yeah 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 this guy this is a giant boss and you're like what a boss and yeah well, I mean, he, he's kind of like a mini boss, but he basically completely wrecks you. Ah! Just close him in there with a bit of napalm. I love it. The kids love it. What is even with that platform? It's a bit phallic looking. I believe you can kind of catch visual of him here. Uh, a little bit too much visual. <laughs> a little bit too much. Don't come up that close. Alright, I, I'm just safe scumming like a champ. Come on, burn him. Burn! Not me. I'm the one burning. And I'm the one who's out of health kits. Did I get him? Nope. Keep getting him! To the freaking night bomb. I have barely any ammo to hit this guy, by the way. Best thing I've got is this thing. Nice. Sweet. But alas, there's no health! So I gotta save scum! Can he just fall over now? Can he just fall over? Just flood him in fire. Oh, gosh. Oh, nice. Alright. We finally killed him, and we gotta wait for the fire. Because there's fire everywhere. Everything's on fire. What am I getting hit by? That turret's not even on anything. It's not even anywhere. 
also also totally just nab that health. It's not even on anything. You've got to be kidding. All right. So you may be wondering what was the point of killing that guy, and I honestly can't remember. I think it's so that this door down here. No, it's the ground floor. But the ground floor is nice because we can stand on some of these teleporters. Particularly that one just puts us behind. Okay. So the third one's nowhere. First one is nowhere. So we gotta go to the second one. There we go. I know there's more of you in there. So I think that's it. I think that's everything we need. I really hope I don't take full damage for dropping down here. Dang. And the, and the doors are still closed. Even better. Uh, at least like the majority of everything in that area is dead, but uh... Big question is, I think you have to get into the door. That's there. So, uh... Where's the door? Come on, fella. Where is thine door? Is it? Dude, just like sometimes you just exit in the weirdest places. Wow, I'm getting so frustrated about this part. I keep bringing this up, but I'm oh, just just bolt it, bolt it. Don't care. All right, so so now we're at the lab, which fortunately there's health. So now we can fight two of these things. I am sick of this mystical double talk. So I think we can open some of this up, and it's it could trigger a lot of dudes. And this looks a bit creepy. Look, so why are even skeletons? But. All the health, I'm gonna take all the health we can get, especially because we do have to eventually... Wow! I just step outside and it's like, oh no, you, you basically take like a deathly amount of damage. Do you wanna maybe not? I don't even know what I'm getting hit by. I don't even know what I was getting hit by. This is crazy. Maybe there's just so many dang enemies. Sometimes this thing doesn't like shoot. Like I, I swear I was just like firing it just then. Oh my gosh, dude, this like. I just want to freaking, I just want to freaking just get past these guys, but nah. We're going to get rid of all your health. Then you can't buy our DVDs. And like, where did any of this come from? Where did any of that come from? Like, oh. You know what I'm gonna do? Oh my gosh. It won't shoot! Why is it not shooting? Alright, hold on. I just wanna shoot him. I just want to sneak back out the way I came. No biggie. Because I want to restock on some ammo. Dang it. And some health. And you also get like all this money like in the middle of things. But like literally at the end of this it just sends you straight to 
the end of the game. So, uh, <laughs> I, I do want to kill this boss though, so. Like, look at all this health I didn't even, like, pick up back here. Where did this area even come from? I don't even know. Are there good secrets in here? Who knows? That's in a couple of minutes, I guess. You are brave, my comrade. I'm proud to be along for the ride. Where did this dialogue come from? Where? I don't even know where I'm even coming from. Her greatest enemy, the freaking spiders. I don't even know where I'm going right now. I'm getting like some ammo, but like... To just like, I'm going around in circles and I don't know where I'm going. It must do something. Uh, by the way, that was uh, one of the three talismans, and in the main playthrough, in the in the in the good, en I, why did I even go this way? In the in the good ending, I will be picking up all three of those because something is good. They were added in uh in the veterans edition, and they give you a nice little bonus before you get to beat the game. It doesn't change the ending, but ah, eh, stop it. <laughs> So maybe we'll be able to get some dang health. How much have, how much money do I have? I still have a bit. Buy some ammo belt. Clipper bullets. Wow, that's actually barely any. Yeah, okay. That's enough. Alright, to the boss! Dude, I just lost so much freaking health just getting here. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, I fired a missile and I might be standing in it. Oh, that's good. Come on, get him! Get him, get him, get him! Get him! Yay! Yeah, alright. So maybe, let's not go in there, let's just fight the guy. What would be the best weapon? What's up to use the sigil? But first, let's clear out a couple of these guys in the way. Also, I can't believe, like, they'd be like, oh, two of them. Also, that thing lowers your health. I think that's why the ammo is low. Maybe that's, that's the problem. That was the secret. I was just consuming all my health by using this thing. Eh. There we go. Easy. <laughs> eh. Eh. Easy. Okay. So I guess we kill both of them and thing hasn't opened yet. It's taking its time. You're not opening, are you? You're not gonna open. But I killed you two like really big guys. Oh, because you gotta do some platforming over here. That's what it is. I actually have no clue. I think this is just to get from A to B. But, uh, maybe you gotta get in that teleporter at the end? Oh no, you gotta get up here. Yeah, yeah. Come on, saving. Yeah. I, I apologize if I'm saving, saves coming so much. 
Hello, Mr. Man. Or... Yeah. Huh. Is this a computer? I don't know. <laughs> I love just how, like, comically, like, violent you can just stab someone. That looks like a secret room, according to the map. Like, it looks like there's a room behind this. Who knows? Uh. Come on, slow staircase. Or lift. Oh my gosh, I, ju I just want to get out. I want to get him. There we go. So, how do you open these Lego bricks here? Definitely not down there. Maybe it's up here. Yeah, maybe it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we are. Okay. Now, we do have to fight this boss. Nope. You're not revealing it? <laughs> Dude, where's the switch? Just to, like, activate the boss. Either that or you have to walk on, like, the... Right here, maybe. There you go. This is what it is. Okay. Behold, everybody! The fourth boss in the game! That guy! Over there! Let's just kill him with a sigil. Oh. It missed. Because he's flying like an idiot. Uh. I want to drop down, but I'm going to take damage if I do it, but I have to do it anyway, so I may as well. So he tries to get you with like a grappling hook, I guess? Actually, I'll just kill this guy normally. Because you can, cause you can kill the bosses with any weapon. You just have to kill the Spectre, which by the way, yeah, guess what, there's another Spectre. Come on, take the hits. There you go. Oh no, a Spectre! Oh, jeez! <laughs> Did you see that mayhem going on over there? This is why you need, like, the auto health, like, thing turned on. Because otherwise these guys just hit you with the most obnoxious attacks. Oh, can't get out of there. He can fly, what is he doing? Come on, get out of there. Get out of there, Mr. Man. I'm right here, dude, you can... Gosh. You can even see him like clipping the ground there. It's a bit weird. Oh my gosh. Can you fly out of that pit any quicker? Oh. Oh. I died. How about we just wail on him? Go close up. He can't kill you when you're close up. Eh! Eh! There we go. And now we have Another number four. Piece. We are one step closer to freedom. And from the looks of it, we're gonna need the full sigil to unlock this puppy. Something tells me this is the end of the rainbow. Huh. Anyway, I guess with that, we'll see you guys next time on Strife, where maybe we won't get as angry. Maybe. We'll see. Anyway, we'll see you guys later. Bye!